when we take that racket back, we're taking that left arm with us. And you'll see, if you've got your left hand on the throat of the racket and you take it back, if I let go, my hand is gonna be in this position. And this is a, a pose in ballet with the hand, where the palm is pointing up, the hand's really relaxed. This is gonna really relax the arm. You're gonna find a lot of power when you do throw that left arm, which is going to turn the shoulders and then open that racket into the shot. So try and keep it there, keep the palm up. And then when you go into your shot, you can throw that hand. Nice. So if you've got that palm up in that lovely relaxed position, that relaxedness is going to resonate through your body. This is super calm. If you tense this arm, it's gonna tense your shoulders up and you're not gonna have that ability to really relax and you'll lose some rotation. If you hold your arm in this position and try and push up against somebody else's hand, there's no power there at all. You turn it over and you push up. That's a strong position. And if you think when we're hitting big, big forehand top spins, we're gonna be pulling the arm up as we rotate before we pull it in. Okay, so if we have our hand down, we haven't got that same power and the rotation is going to come from throwing this left arm. So having that hand open is going to allow you to pull it up with more precision, more power. It's exactly the same on the serve. Keep our hand open, turn it over and you lose that power. This position is going to be more important for you than most people because you've got such a heavy topspin forehand. You need to have all of this super relaxed. You've got loads of rotation, loads of movement in your stroke. So if you tense up at all, having your hand or your shoulders stiff, you're not gonna get nearly as much movement with your shoulders uh, in your rotation. Also, if this hand is tense, this hand is tense. That racket needs to be able to move inside your hand to generate as much topspin as you require. The way we're going to train this into you is you're going to catch the racket with this left hand. Okay, so if it's palm up at the beginning, we throw, we're going to catch it in the ready position, just like we left it. If we were to turn this hand over, you can't catch the racket without then turning it back over. So you let go of the racket, palm up, you catch the racket, palm up, and then you're going to be back into the ready position much faster, ready for the next shot.